them. Most PC games have a plethora of graphics settings that let you strike the perfect balance between quality and performance. Some games let you choose between presets like low, medium, and high, and might even have an auto-detect setting to find the right one for you, but they're not incredibly precise. I love tweaking these settings, but not everybody does. Thankfully, both NVIDIA and AMD have come out with programs that will find the perfect balance for your hardware in one click, so you get the best bang for your buck in no time at all. Here's a quick overview of each program. If you have an NVIDIA card, check out NVIDIA's GeForce Experience tool. It shows you detailed information about your hardware, helps you update drivers, and most importantly, optimizes your settings in one click. First time you start it up, it'll scan your library for games. This doesn't work with every game, but it works with many. Here on the right, you can see your current settings and your recommended settings. Just click Optimize to set them to NVIDIA's recommended levels and start playing. You can even get a preview of what it'll look like at the bottom of the window. Now, everyone has slightly different tastes. I like to have the smoothest experience possible, and NVIDIA's settings caused a few levels to drop below 60 frames per second in Battlefield 3, which I'd prefer not to do. Luckily, GeForce Experience has this slider that lets you set how important performance and quality are to you. This is, again, similar to setting your graphics at low, medium, or high, but it's still much more precise without being any more complicated. If you have an AMD card, you'll want AMD's Gaming Evolved app. This app has a bit more of a social focus, but like GeForce Experience, it can update your drivers and adjust your graphics settings in one click. Just wait for it to scan your library, choose a game, and click Optimize Settings. If you want a slightly less aggressive profile, you can move this slider to Balanced or Performance for a smoother but slightly lower quality sweet spot. It isn't as precise as NVIDIA's tool, but it works well enough. It's a bit of a long-winded explanation, but really it couldn't be simpler. It's a great way to get as much quality possible out of your games without having to learn what each setting does and tweak them one by one in every game. Unless you like doing that, of course, in which case, fire away.